The Orthodox Church of Ethiopia developed rapidly in the north some 1,500 years ago, similar to the growth of European monasteries and churches of the Middle Ages. The strong influence of the independent Orthodox Church had the effect of keeping Ethiopian culture impenetrable from outside forces. Isolated from any progression, the Ethiopians have forgotten the world and the world has forgotten Ethiopia. The Orthodox Church had no influence on agricultural development, but an extreme demand for beeswax for religious ceremonies resulted in a high proportion of the population becoming beekeepers. Due to this high demand, Ethiopia has become the biggest wax and honey producer of the African continent. Particular circumstances have created a negative image of Ethiopia, which is known as the famine basket of the continent. But with its fertile land, it should be known as the bread basket of North Africa and the Near East. If they are convinced after half a year or like this, then we can even help them to train somebody in this chica technology. We can even help them to train somebody technology. One consequence of declining tree cover and expanding agriculture has been accelerated soil erosion. This destruction of tree cover in Ethiopia represents one of the most dramatic human alterations of the country. Ethiopia is losing the ability to feed itself in part because of record population growth and the associated deterioration of the agricultural resource base. Thank you. 